Yo, what's up guys? Today we are heading down to Shane's house right now where we're gonna be putting the mirrors back on along with the removing the roof wrap and the trunk wrap. I'm a little nervous for the mirrors. I really hope they look good. I mean, they look good painted wise, but I held it up yesterday and I mean, it's not a perfect match. It doesn't look completely right, but um, hopefully it looks really good when it's mounted. So I will see you guys when I get there. Alright guys, and just like that, we are at Shane's house now. So pretty much, uh, I'm going to get straight into it. We're going to be putting the mirrors on. Hopefully they come out good, and then we're going to start removing the roof wrap. Why does my car always look so good sitting in his driveway? God. I can't wait to get my own place, guys. It looks so beautiful. Oh, here comes trouble. I was gonna do a cinematic and then you pulled up. <laughs> no, it's fine. All right guys, so here's the mirror right here. Um, this is pretty much how it's gonna look. It's pretty white as you can tell. This is more of an off-white, but and this is very um, white. Um, but pretty much that's how it's gonna look. So I guess it's gonna have to do for now. Um, it is what it is. I can't really do much about that for now. So we're going to go ahead and pretty much put these on and um, then we're going to get started on the roof. Alright guys, so that's pretty much it right there. Yeah, it doesn't look too bad actually. Maybe when I wash the car and actually clean it. So I'm going to go ahead and finish um, both up and then put the interior pieces back together and then we'll move on to the next thing. But it feels good to see it back to white again. It's starting to take shape already. Alright guys, so the mirrors are done. Look at how much of a difference that makes. So they look actually really good. Heck yeah. So I've seen a wet sand and buff them out. Um, again, they're not fully color matched. And then right here they messed up a little bit right in here uh, from sitting down all night. Let me show you the other side. Alright, same thing. So, looks a lot nicer. Again, they just need to be wet sand and buffed. And eventually, I will end up um, either buying new ones or I'll just paint them color matched onto the roof. Alright, guys, so pretty much I'm going to start peeling this off now. I'm probably going to put you on a time lapse for a bit. Um, so, say goodbye to the roof wrap. It was nice while I had it. I like it, but. And I just want something a bit more cleaner now. So I'm gonna use the heat gun and we're gonna start pretty much in this corner. Oh. It's like the wet sand, that's it. Is that where it was? That's it? Okay. Dude, you can hold it. Sad. I want to put it back. <laughs> Come on, muscle. That's hard. <laughs> All right, guys. There it is. Wow. I feel it's so weird seeing it like this. It just looks so clean now and it's just simple, which is what I'm going for. So there's a few spots. I need to um, use some like Goo Gone or something. 
I don't know if it picks up. Yeah, like right there. There's one like right there, and then this piece right here. This is I'm gonna have to like wet sand and wet sand that out maybe. Yeah. Oh, it's already coming out. I'll get that out later. But all right, looks clean. Now onto uh, the trunk. And again, before all you guys get upset about that, it is going to be wrapped another color. I just want to see how it looks white because it's been like a very long time since it's been white and then we'll give this car maybe a good wash or something I don't know we'll see so I'm gonna pretty much by doing this I'm removing um, the tail lights off the trunk so I'm gonna show you guys how to do that okay guys so to take off these uh, it's pretty straightforward actually you just have a 10 right there um let me see actually we remove this so just go ahead and remove this it's pretty easy for the most part and then you'll have another 10 right there right there and right there Okay guys, so pretty much I'm just going to keep them like that, just enough to, you know, be able to do this. So I'm going to remove my plate now, and then we're going to begin uh, removing So comment down below, tell me what you guys think. Do you like it like this? Do you absolutely hate it? Are you pissed that I took all the vinyl off? Comment down below. You can be honest with me, it's fine. But, I mean, I honestly, I personally like it. So I'm going more for that, you know, your very traditional VIP look. Also while keeping it my style. And um, all of this right here, I like the pillars, the um, the mirrors back to white, and the roof back to white. I like all of that. I think it looks very clean, classy. And then the trunk, I like it too. But it's not me. I feel like when it, it's blacked out, that's more my style. Which, it's going to be back to black very soon, guys. I just have to order the vinyl, which will be here. I'll probably order it maybe tonight or tomorrow. So that'll be back and you'll see it's going to be black again but you'll see what exactly it is i'm doing and as i said the interior is going to be matching the trunk as well so i think i'm going to pull it out right now to the street and i'm going to give it a nice little walk
No. That huge part. Remember when we were fucking around in your truck? I was like, we should we should go back to our old ways. Yeah. Remember that? And I was recording it. Hoonigan? Huh? The Hoonigan one? No, yesterday. When we were fucking oh. around right here. And I was like, oh, oh yeah. we should go back to our old ways. Remember when how I used yeah, to yeah, yeah. So I'm back home now. Um, I'm gonna end up ending this video, um, but before I do, real quick, um, so a few things to come before we move on into the interior is some body work. Um, not too long ago, I actually hit something. Um, the lip caught pretty good, which gave me um, this crack all right here. It's not that big, but I mean, if I could probably chip it off for you. No, you can't. Well, this is cracked, which means um, this whole section is going to have to be fixed and repainted, repaired and all that. And then I'm also going to be repainting the whole bottom lip and everything, kind of cleaning all of that up, um, you know, all this. So the front bumper is going to be coming off very soon. Um, there's my trunk. The rear bumper, I've already told you before as well. Um, I backed into something. Whoa, almost fell. And um, the fins caught. I know you can't really see right now, but the fins caught. So the paint chipped off of that, and it gave me a crack here and um, on that side. So that's all going to be getting fixed and repainted as well. But um, comment down below, though, if you guys like the new look, the white top. Let me know if you guys like that or not, or if you like it better um, blacked out. Um, you know, so it's looking really good. Um, I already, I'm in love already now with this car all over again. It just looks, in my opinion, a lot cleaner, way better. So, um, the wheels as well are going to be coming off soon. The OEM ones are going to be going back on, um, because I'm going to be stripping all of that off as well. And those are going back to chrome, and I'm going to polish the shit out of them. Um, basically, we're going full VIP, guys, which means, um, I want the car to look as clean as possible while having my twist on it. And my twist is pretty much the rear bumper that I have, the, ex the way the exhaust is, the vinyl wrap that's in between with this whole blacked out in be um, this whole blacked out section. There's really not very many other LSs. Actually, I don't think there's any LSs that have the whole blacked out like me. I know they have that blacked out, but not the whole thing. Um, and it's going to look really cool once the new vinyls in you guys will see it is black but there's a twist to it um so that's gonna look good and the interior is gonna be matching that so pretty much guys once the body repairs are done which is gonna be pretty quickly done pretty quickly um once those are done 
I am, and that rear panel is vinyl wrapped. We're gonna move into the interior and we're gonna start um, pretty much re-wrapping um, those, the whole center piece, which is carbon fiber, pretty much all the door cards or um, the little door panels. And then that's when we'll move into kind of, um, you know, y yeah, you get what you'll have to, you'll have to wait and see. But um, that's when we'll move into all that. And I am going to be getting some table trays. I used to make trays myself. So I'm thinking about actually making my own again very soon. <coughs> all right, I need to put this camera down. I'm still sick. I'm getting over it, so it's, bear with me. It's still pretty hard to breathe. But um, anyways, guys, comment down below. Let me know if you guys like where the car is heading. I'm going to order this tonight, actually. I'm really excited for it. I like the white. It looks cool. It looks simple, but it's not me. Um, and therefore, we're going to change that up. I think you guys are going to dig it. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Comment down below if, what you guys think of everything that I've done so far in the past couple days. Um, subscribe if you guys aren't ready. A lot of changes are coming to the car. Uh, hit that thumbs up if you guys like the way my car looks. And until then, guys, peace out.